When the NBC News team arrived at the clinic on Monday, the building was locked with only a security guard on the premises. Community members say the clinic operated half day on Friday. Johannes Mashare, chairperson of the Village Development Council and junior headman says the nurses left for a meeting at Rundu Intermediate Hospital that day. The clinic caters for surrounding villages including Mororo, Fumbe, Rujaja and Muguva. Mashare says the clinic's water issue has been ongoing since the water pump element of a borehole supplying water to the clinic was damaged six months ago. He says the ministry is aware of the situation. The borehole element was damaged and taken to Rundu for repair. Until now, we do not know how far they've come with fixing it. It's almost six months now, and they've brought a water tank without a lid. The water in that tank is not clean. Things fall in there. The water is not appropriate for sick people to drink. If you come at this clinic, even the toilets are old. These are pit latrin. They do not flush, which is not good for a clinic. Even nurses don't use them. Even the nurses' homes are dilapidated. The toilets do not have water. We raised this point with the ministry, but the ministry has not heard us out. Mashare confirmed to the NBC News team that the decision to close the clinic was taken during a meeting held last week between the clinic staff and the VDCs. He further stated that the community will demonstrate if the ministry fails to resolve the matter. A member of the Village Development Committee, Johannes Monango, says the ministry is not consistent in its providing clean water to the clinic. He noted that a tank was provided to supply water to the facility, but this often runs out without being refilled. It has gotten to a point where the clinic relies on nearby houses and the river for water. <laughs> The nurses are not getting water as they were supposed to. For them to get water, at times they have to ask the security guard or the cleaner to go and fetch water at the river in one container. Health-wise, it is not a good thing that the clinic operates without water. This is a clinic that works with people's health. While the team was busy conducting interviews, a patient showed up. Paolo Mukoya says he was not aware that the clinic closed. I do take medication for high blood pressure. And I do come for follow-ups every month. My medication finished last month. Upon arrival here, I am told the clinic is closed. I walked 15 kilometers from Mangundu village. If Mashare Clinic will be closed, then it is going to be difficult for us to get treatment, as we are based inland. From Mashare Clinic, the nearest clinic is 13 kilometers away at Mupapama, west of Mashare, or 12 kilometers away at Shambu, east of Mashare village. Walter Kamaya, public relations officer in the health ministry, denied the clinic's closure, arguing that services to the facility were not discontinued. He further highlighted that the borehole pump at Mashare Clinic became unoperational around October 2023. Kamaya says the region made provision to provide water to Mashare Clinic with a mobile tank and containers to cater to the facility daily from Rundu Intermediate Hospital. He says arrangements have been made for the procurement of a new borehole pump. Elizabeth Mwengo, NBC News, Mashare.